Welcome to this series of Lenten podcasts. My name is Father Andrew Seiler. I am pastor at St. Rose in Council Grove, Kansas, and also Mission Parish St. Anthony's in Strong City to again welcome you to these Lenten series reflections. The Gospel passage for our daily reflection on this Friday after Ash Wednesday is from the Gospel of Matthew. The disciples of John approached Jesus and said, Why do we and the Pharisees fast much, but your disciples do not fast? Jesus answered them, Can the wedding guests mourn as long as the bridegroom is with them? The days will come when the bridegroom is taken away from them, and then they will fast. Our Gospel passage presents us with the disciples of John going to Jesus, perhaps out of curiosity, out of perhaps wondering why his disciples have it such much easier than they and the Pharisees, since they fast and do all kinds of other ritual um, devotions to give God glory. But Jesus gives a a simple um, answer that um, the wedding guests, those that partying with the groom, the bridegroom, um, do not mourn until they have lost or the bridegroom um, leaves them. So this presents to us that yes, Jesus is the bridegroom. He is our uh, joy. Um, There will be a time to fast, but that he is with us, it is a a time to rejoice. But for our season of Lent, it is a time for us to use the gifts of uh, Lent, of prayer, of fasting, and of uh, almsgiving, especially fasting, not only giving up to do a sense of penance, but also to gauge our ability, our attachment um, from worldly things, because we are destined through our faith for eternal life, or otherworldly, for heaven. So if we are attached to the world, then um, we need to work on that. We need to let go. So I think the, the disciples of John, and perhaps us, want perhaps some some fruit from our fasting, and it will uh, come in the end. So um, let us praise, pray that God will continue to allow us on this journey of faith in this Lenten season.